Yo, what's good people? It's Jay Cactus, and I'm back again with my favorite series where I take influence from other countries and cultures and turn it into a UK drill beat. I've covered a lot of the globe, man. I've done a lot of countries so far, but in this video, I'm going to be focusing on Albanian music. I want to flip something traditional and I think I found a perfect sample, so I can't wait to get into this one, man. But before I do, I want to let you all know that I just dropped my brand new bundle, the Deep Suite. If you missed my last few videos, it's 10 brand new kits combined into one huge bundle and there's almost a thousand unique sounds midi files and presets easily my hardest kit yet so if you want to check that out i've left a link in the description and let's get straight into the video all right so here's the sample i found i don't know how i'm gonna flip it yet but i've definitely got some ideas i just want to take something from that part sounds crazy and then i can see if there's some other parts further on but the main part i want to focus on is this intro needs cleaning up though there's a lot of noise in there all right so i'm going to set my bpm to 145 and then i'm just going to roughly take like four or eight bars so i think it finishes like there so let's bring this back but this bit's a bit longer so what i'm going to need to do is just make some cuts and then we'll just scroll the mouse wheel Make a cut there and then I'm going to take this part, copy this over. There we go. It's more in time. And then let's try pitch this down. It's just this part here. I think that needs to start there. That needs to come back. And then I'm just going to stretch this out, make this one unique and then we'll stretch that out. All right, the chops are sounding sick. I just need to clean it up a bit. And then I'm wondering if we could take these vocals at the end. We might feel underneath it. Let's see what we can do. That sounds kind of sick. Alright, but to clean up the sample, I've just got X noise cutting out some of that hissing noise. A compressor just to tame some of the peaks. You can copy these settings if you want. And then an EQ to take out some lows, some highs, and then some of the muddy frequencies. And then also the sample was panned to the left and it wasn't too wide. So I wanted to spread it. So I panned it from here to the right so it was centered. And then I spread it. Just a bit more balanced that way. So yeah, I think we could definitely do something with the vocals. I'm gonna copy all of these settings, send this to insert two, make these even wider. And then we'll try some Alter Boy. Could pitch it up an octave. A bit squeaky though. Could filter it out though. That could work. Only in some parts though, so I'm going to leave it there. Definitely need some more layers though, so I'm going to add a pattern for the instruments. We'll go to my Aquarius Analog Lab Bank. I'm going to choose this Suspense preset. That could work. D sharp too. All right, let's clone Analog Lab, and I want to get a sub bass in there. Just something gritty. Mm, like this one. We'll just drag the same note out. It's starting to sound more full now. these beats i don't like to go crazy with all the count melodies and things but i do want to layer it with something like a pad but i could take something like this in my dream preset also my aquarius bank we could make a chord see if it fits oh, that sounds kind of hard you know and then we could just add a smaller note so but i like it even pitch the second one up an octave so it's like this Stands out a bit more. Just to see, I always like to render the full melody and then see if I can flip it. Sounds kind of similar. Like the way that part sounds though. Let's try this. Pitch it back up. Let's see what it sounds like after the normal one. That could be a switch up. And then also in some parts, I'm gonna wanna add kickstart. Mm, we'll just add bounce to some parts. Last thing we could add though, is just one of my accents. In the one shot kit, there's over 30 accents and these are crazy to add underneath. 
something like that could be sick. And if you're trying to work out where it should go, if you just bring this time knob up, it will snap it. I'm gonna pitch this one up a full octave. And then we'll add my new portal preset bank. I'm gonna add this phase pulse preset, just bring down the mix of it. And then I'm gonna add this pulsing preset in my Perlina bank. After that, we can just filter it out. Just make some cool texture. I've just rendered that. I'll cut the end off and then bring it back. There we go. All right, it's getting a bit messy now and all I need is these parts. And I don't know if anybody knew this, but you can actually create a second arrangement. So I can name this flipped melody, copy the first one and then paste it. Just because I wanted to save these in case I needed them, but I'm not working with them right now. And I'm just going to use the accent somewhere else in a build up. But for now, I think that's going to be enough. So let's get some drums in. I already know we're going to use the best drill kit of 2023, the hydro drum kit. And I want some kind of heavy one like this. Tick one's one of my favorites too. And to save a bit of time, we could use a countdown name MIDI. I always just look in the bottom left until I find a type of pattern I want. So I just want something simple, but then we'll get rid of some of the rolls. Yeah, like that, we'll copy this. And I just want a lighter one to layer some of them with. Like this one or this rougher one. And then with this third one, I'm just going to create a bit of bounce. So yeah, I like to leave the count snares kind of spacious for these type of beats. Let's find an interesting snare. Something like this one. Could even layer that with this mole snare. Mm. Sitting. All right, let's grab one of the 808s. There's some crazy ones in here, man. But I just love using this Stax one. Designed it from scratch in Serum, and it just sounds mad for these beats. Try some of it away, it's just in case. My two Jacked one sick, Robot one two, and the static one, man. Let me know in the comments what you prefer. Even this roller one, man. All sounded crazy. Okay, let's grab a hit, something like this one. Like always, we can just pan these as well. Right, I'm gonna make this pattern longer because I wanna change up the 808s. Copy these. Mm. Try pitching these up an octave. And then just copy that pattern and add it like here. It might be kind of excessive for the pattern, but it could work in one part. All right, since the energy is getting a bit crazy, of course, we're going to add a drum fill. So many sick ones. Maybe just a quick one, you know? Just going to pan those eight ways too. All right, that's definitely enough, man. I don't need to add anything else. So I've just split everything and I don't need kicks out on the hallway. I'll automate this. 
let's just figure out how to arrange it. I think I just take the sample before it has the strings and everything. We'll render this and that was from the first arrangement. So yeah, we'll take this. All right, so we'll have a longer intro. We'll take this, get a sub bass. Yeah, there we go. Could take some counter snares too. Save these other counts there as well. We can kick start back in. Forgot about the accent too. We could add this to the intro. I think that needs to be the bridge. Maybe we take that for the verse. Or we just take the sample without the strings. Save the kicks. Then maybe we change the eight weight here. And bring the hit back. Yeah, there we go. In fact, let's get the reverse vocal part in here. Mm, forgot about that part. And then I think this one has the other vocals. play normally for the bridge and then from there we can just copy the whole thing or we could try a longer fill like this crazy i think a riser as well you know we'll just add my second tag real quick then for the outro we can just take that and then fade it out here yeah this beat sounded crazy man let's have a listen from the beginning so i just added spaced out to the intro and automated the forming so it can rise up. This is sounding so sick. Check out the deep suite in the description.